Next year you shout hallelujah if the Lord has blessed you and has touched you. It is happening there. Put your hands together. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. It is happening there. Amen. Yes. Yes, we are still checking. Who is number two? Who is number two at the front there? Back right hand. Check it. And shout that we may know. And start coming out now. Start coming out to the front. To testify to the goodness of the Lord. And put the devil to shame. Keep on checking. Keep on checking yourself. And all those who are moving, please stay where you are. Because the Lord is at work already. We are waiting for number two, number three, number four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Countless number now. We are waiting. God bless those who are checking themselves. And let's now begin to come out, please. Worship the Lord now as we start coming out and checking ourselves now. Give praise to the Lord. Give praise to the Lord. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Put your hands together for Jesus. We are waiting for the worship team to please give us the music and let people begin to come out now from the back and from the center and all parts of the, uh, of the crowd. We are waiting for those whom the Lord has touched. And they are coming out now. Check your eyes. Check your ears. Bend down. Rise up. And then give God a great shout of praise if the Lord has touched you and healed you. The itching is stopped. The pain has vanished. The swelling is gone. Anointing breaks the yoke. The power has been released by the man of God. He has collected the power for us and released to us. Now begin to come out. Check yourself. Amen. that song is going on if you have been sitting on the wheelchair rise up and dance say amen, amen. if you've been paralyzed before rise up and dance if you've been deaf before listen to the music and dance the power has been released and as we are singing together now you are coming out to testify let's sing together again and give God the praise and put your hands together Right hand side, our leaders, please come out there. The medical team, we want you to come out here. 
and help us to interview those who are coming out to testify to the goodness of the Lord. Let's come to the left side here of the stage. Look at where I'm pointing to. All our leaders, please come downstairs and help us to interview them as they're coming out so they can testify. The same thing online, on any of the social media platform, check yourself, check what the Lord has done for you and begin to send your testimony so we can rejoice with you here. All over the world, in Asia, in um, America, and the South and the North of America, South Africa, East Africa, Central Africa, all over the world, Caribbean, China. Check yourself wherever you are and see. All over the world, there is testimonies loading right here at the Alpha location, as I am calling in Lawrence State. There are a lot of testimonies right here. There are testimonies galore. There are a lot of things happening here, and we are so grateful to God. If you are joining us right here online, you want to join in this celebration of testimonies because like the literal meaning in um, English, right here, the name of the location is there for singing. There's a lot of singing here because there's great, so great testimonies. If you are here online and you have gotten your testimonies, all you have to do for us right now is to go to the comment section and tell us what the Lord has done for you. Right here on YouTube, right here on the GS Facebook page, right here on the church Facebook page, you can go on the comment section and tell us what you do have gotten from God. Right now, we want to share your testimony. We want to read from you. We are waiting for, for you right here. So go online, go on the comment section right now, if you're joining us, and share your testimony. Don't forget, you can also join us via Telegram, gclm.com forward slash testimony, or go to testimony channel for GCLM testimony on, on Telegram because you know, there has been a supernatural deliverance tonight right now before i leave you we are waiting for you go on the comment section right there and tell us what the lord has done for you tonight is a night of supernatural deliverance and we are waiting for you check yourself do what you have never been able to do before stand up jump up do something because god has done something permanent for you right now I will say goodbye because you're coming back and you will listen to great testimonies right here from the Alpha location at Ayankori um, Fara State. And also, I want to know where you are joining us from because it will be good to know where you are joining us from. Tell me the location. I'll be looking at the comment right now. Tell us the location you are joining us from. And right now, we are joining the Alpha location because great things are happening here. Bye bye. I'll put your hands together for Jesus. Sua Cheki can know that something has happened to them. Now we have some people already lined up to testify, but we still want to wait a little bit, maybe one more minute, to check those who are still staying among the crowd, in the crowd there. Check yourself. I cannot be tired of repeating that statement, that you should check. And once you check it, you will see it. And once you see it, you begin to come out to testify. Is anybody still checking there? Good. Check, check your legs and your hands and your eyes and your ears and all the swellings. Everything has been healed by God. Now we want to listen to one testify. Others are lining up. Don't go home without checking yourself and testifying. 
to the glory of God. Now the first testifier. for five years and the mother had to leave Lagos migrated to Quara State in search of a cure the boy couldn't look at the light couldn't see anything according to her story but today tonight after the prayer of the man of God the boy opened his eyes and began to see he saw he saw uh, what is it called now the, the, the flying machine there he saw the drone and he said, Mommy, Mommy, I could see something fly. I could see something fly. Put your hands together for Jesus. I tell you, that's the finger of God. That's Praise the finger Lord. of God. Check yourself now with that alone and come. Another testifier. Praise Look, the Lord. Amen. Hold on, brother. You see, it's very sweet to listen to other people's testimonies. What about your own? Your own is there with you. You check up. You will see the challenge has been taken away. That prayer was set to heaven. And heaven answered instantaneously, healing that little boy who has been blind for five years years what about you if you check your own you will see what the lord has done another testifier please praise the lord i'm bro motor shop i have a finger trip for the past four months i was unable to use my thumb to write anytime i hold pen to write this thumb we got teeth and i won't be able to raise the thumb Anytime I want to raise the thumb, I have to use the other hand to raise the thumb. But as God did it for me, I pray he's going to do yours in Jesus' name. Now I can fold my thumb perfectly to write perfectly and release the thumb perfectly. My See thumb you? is working perfectly. Can you write, there is no brother? Any or transit, there is no hey, end of There is no pain. Praise the Lord. Please, can you write? Can you write with the thumb? Hold the pen and write. I can write perfectly with the thumb. Now do it. Let them well, see. See what is happening. Well, Amen. Uh, God bless you, brother. Enjoy your healing. He has, uh, I'm a medical practitioner. He has what we call trigger finger. That is unable to use his finger well. Arthritis, degeneration. So once the finger bends like this, it will not turn back unless he pushes it back. But now the Lord has healed him. Praise the Lord. Well, that's the medical angle to it. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ.
Praise the Lord. Oruko mini Aliu Jami wa Isaiah. Ah, nimba timo okada ni mama anje. So mwa ibe ya yewa kumini track kwa ba kumu yimbo. So tima tinsha okada Lord tima tiri bidon ti ti ba bati ni program ma pack. Awo yama wume kwa eri ene ane tosha okada o pack yowa ba kumu yi. Suddenly mwa ibe kwa ni ba ba mwa si kwa na miba yi. Ah, mwa deni phone lawa muni ola mwa lori ba ba kumu yi. Mo de fer coffee jimbe mi oni phone. Ode di jo keji olande she phone. Ingwa to ma di jo keta olande to she camera. Ah, mo ni e ingwa to wa ya mo lo play boni kabi two years ago. Timba lo si toilet wa be mi wa leni because ma ti le bere ba mi le di dema. Ningwa ti da di wa ni ka for kabi to do wa mo she for kori mo to wa for kan ese. So suddenly mo kaja repe bi pe ni le pa kan be mi ana mi kan shaky. So as I live by, but live better by, but to live deeper than if you go for love. Put your hands together for Jesus. This man has been invited to our fathers in the Lord various uh, meetings, crusades, and he's been trying to attend. But then tonight he came to this particular crusade with the problem he had been suffering from for 22 years. Think about that and the legs. And the pain at the back, he could not. It said if he, if you went to the toilet, they had to bring him back out of the toilet. He couldn't walk by himself. It's so painful, very, very painful and disturbing. But then tonight, after the prayer of the man of God, the pain disappeared. The legs began to function, and he could bend down and rise up. You've seen it now. Say amen. That's why we keep telling you: if you don't check it, you don't see it. You need to check it. If you check it, the miracle is there. We have been told. Another testifier, please. Yeah, go. What? Praise the Lord. Praise the living God. By the special grace of God, my name is Edith Usman. I'm from Gomo region, from Agaji Street. I want to thank God for the goodness of God to what God has done for me in the crusade. This is my leg, that there is something that shook inside my leg, that at that thing I've been almost three months, that it does not come out. I will even use needle to push it out for where it cannot come out. My husband has tried, my children have tried. But I believe God that I'm coming to come and see our Father in the Lord. And God Almighty, as He pray this hour of the day, this night, I believe that I don't know how that he come up. That is how that he come up. Pray the living God. So what happened to the leg now, madam? Fast, I can walk before, I cannot walk, but now I can jump, I can move from jump, that place. Jump. Amen. Amen. The first brother, the brother testified, said he felt electricity. Now, this sister said, that thing just came out, <laughs> electricity. Put your hands together for Jesus. Mm -hmm. 